Let's get you back out to that mansion in Oak Hill that was completely destroyed just a couple of hours ago by a two alarm fire. Yeah, Channel 4's Ann McCloy is live at the scene where firefighters are still keeping an eye on those hotspots, I guess just because of the house. It was so big. Yes, that's right, Adrian. Firefighters describe this like fighting a warehouse fire. It is kind of a mini mansion, five bedrooms, 6,000 square feet. And look at all of this damage now. This is our first daylight shot. Uh, we haven't been able to see this, but you can see that the back of the home is gone and the roof is gone as well. And that's what firefighters say has been such a problem because there's a ton of debris on the ground. And they say that debris could rekindle inside the home. I want to show you the video. Pretty amazing around two this morning when we arrived. Neighbors said when they walked out and saw the flames, they were just shocked about 30 feet high and it looked like a fireball right over the roof of the home. Now, one neighbor said he wasn't sure if the family of four who lives here was home or not, but he made some phone calls and did talk to them confirming that they were on vacation there in Mobile, Alabama for spring break. The fire grew so large though at one point next door neighbors had to be evacuated. It's a horrible shame. It's a beautiful house. We've socialize with our neighbors several times. They're, they're wonderful people. Now, the district fire chief told us that uh, he told the family, he had to tell the family this was a total loss. They weren't sure since they're not here how bad the damage was, and he said that was just heartbreaking to have to tell them that, them being seven hours away uh, right now. But another live picture out here this morning. We do know that the fire started in the back master bedroom, which is located on the first floor of the home. We don't know the cause right now, and fire crews are on their way back. Actually Actually see a fire truck about to pull up and they're going to keep watch of the home uh, for the next couple of hours. But just again, what a relief that the family was gone. That's one good thing we can say that they weren't here. Nobody was hurt because the kids, their bedrooms are upstairs, so it could have been really bad. I'm reporting live in Oak Hill and McCloy, Channel 4 News Today. All right, and thank you so much for that.